Hey everybody, it's Dr. McVeary here, and I want to welcome you to the Institute on Active Learning and Mathematics. And I know one of the big concerns we have with using Google Meets and all the in Google Docs with all our younger students is how do we get them to use the URL when it's just this long extension of random letters? Well, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can make a Google Doc and just put those links behind a picture and give your young students a visual cue and not really even have to worry about those links. So the first thing you do is you have to have your links with a lesson. And I have, you know, my stars group, my cartoons group, my sharks group, my flowers group, and my cars group. And I'm just going to make a new document, file, new, document. And I'll call this breakout rooms. And, you know, if I want, I can insert a table. You don't have to, but um, sometimes it's easier for people to use with the table. So I'll go to insert, table, one, two, three, four, five. And then I need to insert a picture. Um, let's search the web. And the first group is stars. And I can pick that and insert it. All right. And, you know, you can change the picture size however way you want. Um, and I can go now, I go to my stars breakout room. All right. I'm going to go to the share link, copy the link, go back to my breakout room thing. Now, see this picture? All right. I want to insert a link in the picture. And I just link to that breakout room. And now I can do the next one and add a picture for cartoon characters. And so I'll go to insert image, search the web, Tomcat. Gary. Mouse. All right. And I can insert and then once again i can resize it go back to my cartoon group get that share link copy the link go back to my document and again let's insert the link right there paste it in and hit apply and that is how you can add the links right into the um, window.